Father Taylor here. It's only Tuesday. This is not your weekly e-blast. I'm here today with a heavy heart to uh, let you know that our dear sister, Sally Paul, has died and gone to be with the Lord. Sally and uh, Sam came here to Trinity back in 1962. They were 24 years old. Can hardly believe it. <clears throat> uh, two of their three kids were baptized here. Three of them were confirmed. Uh, and Sally, as you know, was um, very much a part of the life of everything in the church. <clears throat> she served for many years as the head of the altar guild, had a tremendous impact on every Sunday. Uh, Sally and Sam were always part of those early Faith Alive teams, and um, uh, she just was, you know, kind of the life of the church even in her last years. And so it's really hard to uh, to say goodbye, but we do so in the midst of hope, and the hope that comes from the resurrection of Jesus, the hope that was Sally's for for many years, especially during her all that time here at Trinity Church. The service itself will be held on Saturday, November 19th, for reasons of, uh, to help the family be able to gather uh, together from, <clears throat> from all over. So uh, today's announcement is really just to let you know, of, uh, despite our hope, it's still hard. We grieve. Jesus at the grave of his, his friend Lazarus, even though he knew he was about to rise from come back from the dead, that Jesus wept. And so we grieve. We grieve with Sam and we grieve with the three sons and their wives and the five grandchildren. And we grieve with all those who knew and loved her. And so um, just thought I would offer a prayer as part of our um, announcement. Into your hands, O merciful Savior, we commend your servant, Sally. Acknowledge we humbly beseech you a sheep of your own fold, a lamb of your own flock, a sinner of your own redeeming. Receive her into the arms of your mercy, into the blessed rest of everlasting peace, and into the glorious company of the saints in light. Amen. So we'll keeping you up to date with any other news. And uh, we look forward to, again, getting together in the importance of our fellowship face-to-face. -face. Goodbye for now.